It's time for us to talk ball, presented by Dunkin' with General Manager John Robinson. Hope you get to spend some time with your family on Thanksgiving Day, a little downtime at least. Yeah, it was good to break a little bread with them, have a little family fellowship. Des Fitzpatrick is a, is a pretty interesting story. After you drafted him in April, he doesn't make the ball club initially. For 75 days, he's on the practice squad, and now he's part of the team. Talk to me about his improvement and what he adds. Yeah, I mean, he's really worked hard and probably improved as about as much as any player on, on the football team. Every receiver is different, and they've got to kind of find their niche. And, you know, Dez is improving on, on doing that. He made some contested catches for us in the Houston game, and we're going to lean on him here as we move forward. All right, let's talk about this weekend's opponent, the Patriots. They've won five in a row. They're seven and four, and it seems like the improvement has largely been keyed by a defense that is just stopping everybody. What's got their defense going now? Yeah, they're, they're playing really sound defense, Mike. You know, they got a bunch of good players on that side of the ball, but they're all playing well together. You know, Hightower and Bentley in the middle. You know, those are two big, fast linebackers that you know, really lead the charge. They've got Van Oy and Judon on the edge, really disruptive edge guys. I think overall team defense, they're playing really sound football right now. What has impressed you about their rookie quarterback, Mac Jones? Uh, I think it's his poise. You know, he has been really poised. Uh, you can tell that he's played at, at a high level uh, at a big time program like Alabama. He's taken command. You can see him being vocal in the game, on the sidelines. Uh, he's been decisive with his throws. He's making good decisions. Stage certainly hasn't proved too big for him. So no surprise, big challenge this weekend for the Titans. Yeah, we're gonna have to play good football this weekend, Mike. Talking about good football right now, let's talk about some of the top players in the state of Tennessee. Earlier this week, the announcement made the finalists for the Tennessee Titans Mr. Football Awards, which will be presented on December 7th. John Robinson is gonna be there, excited to have that all go down. Why is it so important for this organization to support high school football in the state of Tennessee? Well, I mean, I think that's where the foundation is laid, you know, from a football standpoint. You know, that's where these guys learn you know, the importance of hard work and, and teamwork and dedication and sacrifice and accountability. Being a part of that, supporting that, uh, putting our arm around high school football here in our great state is something that's extremely important to us.